All right, welcome back to Let's Play Europa Universalis Four as the Netherlands. Today, I think we're gonna examine our options on what we want to do with our various claims here. We are waiting. Oh, actually, they don't have a truce with them anymore. But ah, but they're at war again with some major players. So, okay, I had forgotten about that. So, um, I think we could try to take care of England. Uh, without their help, but certainly navally, uh, I don't think we are ready to, well, I think we actually might have more heavies in them. Let's take a look at the naval situation. Uh, da -da -da -da, navies. Mm -hmm. No, I feel pretty damn good about that. Uh, yeah, I feel like we could make a crossing. Let's look at armies. I mean, we're probably just going to be fighting England basically on our own and I, I want to do this because if we switch if we switch to Protestant before uh, and we don't have the Emperor ship um, we it'll lower our, our force limit and here's us right below Spain and France above Muscovy and England's all the way down here 15,000 like we have 15,000 just like hanging out in Scandinavia I realized that I did this wrong that I needed to uh, add it to the Empire but I can I can do that later once I integrate them um, and I'm coring this stuff up so that I can uh, yeah. But I can actually just go ahead and, and release Holstein. Uh, as an independent prince. And yeah. He's in the Empire and everything. Mm -hmm. It's Protestant, which is fine. Um, I'll go ahead and... Well, mm, I was going to guarantee him, but whatever. We are still above our stuff for this. Yep. Um, I have a feeling uh, that I'll have to probably lose one of my elector. Like, there's no reason to have so many elector va elector people if I'm not the emperor. I think monsters. Yeah, monsters Protestant sure isn't. So probably them. Cologne is also still. Yeah. The Platinate. Okay, so the Bohemia is likely to slip slip to Protestant, if I had to guess. But they're also kind of a wreck right now. And of the people that we're likely to get replaced by, yeah, it looks like Austria right now. Um, who's our rival, which sucks. So this is a good time to, to actually take land from the Empire. Burgundy is a prince in the Empire now, so... Uh, and so is the Yezh. I believe they are allied. Oh, they're also allied with Sweden. Sweden's busy. What can we do with this? Oh, ooh, what? Did they guarantee them or something? Oh, okay. I'm not scared of Great Britain. Um, then this is the thing. Uh, France has, like, has all kinds of problems. We call in Munster and Cologne. Um, oh, I saw the truce with them. What one of my truce ran out? And this is when France's troops were around too. Okay, so three years. Okay, so I guess about 1540 is when we'll have to think about switching. Now, oh, um, they are on their own at the moment, and they don't have any coastlines. So we're looking at 16,000. All right. Um, let's build up to our force limit. Cannon. And 
some man dudes. There we go. And as we finish coring, are we finished coring? No, we just started coring. Warm of boots. Yes. Okay. Castilian Brazil. I'd really like to get that finished. How many colonies am I working on at once? And am I sending any anywhere? No. Um. Okay. There's a reason this is here. So that I can get down to the cape. So let's let's pull this off of here. And since I actually have to work at it, let's start doing more here. Um, I also probably want to start claiming these guys. Claiming them up. Um... Yeah, it, it's it's a huge pain in the ass when you can't just declare war because you have the the thing anymore. Um, the idea group. Working on our last thing for this, we got uh, this tech to do, um, which doesn't give us much, honestly, but it's fine. Do we have any missions to discover India like England does? We have missions to... <laughs> take in... Oh, we have to go over there, so... Uh. Uh, let's just keep working on South America so we can get around to this colony. Uh, so we can maybe do it this way instead. Alright. Um, and yeah, since we have the free guy, we will claim up uh, this one. So, if we, if we attack Great Britain first, who are we looking at Great Britain, allied-wise? Nobody. Oh, yeah, and I could do colonial stuff and take them out over here. Uh -huh. Seize a colony here. Or two. That's an interesting idea. We'll think about that. Alright, so no allies. Um, just a shitty um, a colony who's got 2k troops with, uh, you know, not much going on there. Uh, let's get our troops out of Norway first. I can't believe I was sieging the wrong province. I was, I was, um, not cheesing the wrong comments, but I was. These aren't my main amount of, <laughs> of units. This is, this is very small. Looks like I'm going to need my transports. Um... And they're over here, aren't they? Where are they? Where are my transports? Down here, okay. Hmm. 
I gotta wait anyway. Because of this. Actually. While we're a great power, maybe we can break their alliances with the. Uh, with the other guys. Burgundy. No. Okay. Uh, back to Saxony, I guess. So what's this war about? Uh, looks like England actually got their claim on Paris. Can't do that because it's a monarchy. Okay. He just lost a free city. Um, I think maybe in some of the shakeups we'll probably try to release some other guys. But I'm going to improve my relations with him, even though I can't. Uh, probably by the time we get it high enough, uh, he'll have that cord, so. Yes. Well, allying the Papal States is not a big deal. Alright. <laughs> I might be done shipping these guys over before. Does, um, Norway still have claims on this stuff? No, they don't, because they are given to them. So we got our big ships here. Probably have to pull in. I mean, these aren't inland seas, are they? I can't really click on them. I think it's like here that it starts. No, here. <clears throat> so the galleys, little galleys I have is probably not very useful at all. It looks like they're pretty old galleys anyway. Aha. There we go. There's my my uh my transports. There's no reason they even send that up there. The cannon. Mm. I may want to pull my uh, my trade ships out of service as well. How much filler do they have? I just looked at this, but uh, yeah. I think, um, I think I'll lose a little bit of money doing it, but, uh, 
a lot of this is paying for upkeep of my troops and I can <clears throat> I'm thinking about what I want to do as far as, like, taking the land going. Um, like, do I want to try to do it from Ireland? Because then I'd have to go through... It looks like there's not very many forts in Ireland. Actually, I only have to take care of Calais on the coast here. Oh, and they've mothballed the fort. Oh, they've mothballed the fort. You know what? They mothballed London. No. They mothballed any other ones. This one, they've mothballed this one. Alright, so if I can, um. Have about 15,000. Well. Sligo. Um, I sort of feel like I want to get the rest of these guys back, but. Yeah, there's no reason to have the. the cannons and stuff here. There's only 8,000 natives. <sighs> this is really only a stepping stone to much easier places to colonize. Down here. Okay. Um... I suppose I might want to start claiming stuff in Ireland? I already have a claim here. Which ends before I'll be finished with the war. They're not even allied to the Irish miners. Uh, this guy's a vassal, though. I could make them release some of Ireland, but I don't think so. and our rivals. Well, there we go. Kings County is this one. Right here. Thanks. Thanks, game. Oh. Alright. Um, no tech thing I can do. I already finished my military idea, which is kind of not really a military idea. <laughs> okay. Let's go for cost. Uh, probably should have did the edict before that, but that's fine. Let's call you off for now. Okay. England, your time has come. Mostly because it's not yet time for Burgundy. Is there anywhere else I can snipe a fort? No. Ah, oh, they started... They started paying for them. Eh. So I think the best place to do would be to... Okay.
All right, the garrison is still zero. Uh, they really can't do anything in Munster and Cologne. Um. So we won't call them in. Oh, I can promise France land. Uh, but France probably wants this. What is, uh... What does France want? Hmm... Yeah, no. All right, here we go. This is actually really dangerous. I want to just put them in the boats. Apparently I only need a tiny amount of that. Ah, okay. Fine. What am I doing? Just go. Yeah, I think I will actually take Kent. Oh, shit! <laughs> Hello! Hello, personal union with Saxony. How are you doing? <laughs> uh. Well, I'm gonna be fucked her. Actually, because I'm focusing on it quite a bit. Oh! It's not kicked in yet. Okay. Um... Yes. Okay, that'll act as a distraction here. Now, they can build up quite a bit, so... I'm... I'm gonna be quite sure of that. Yeah, it looks like they're going up that way. Good. Will act as a fine distraction. Yep, there they go. I'll let him chase me around. I am gonna want to core some stuff, but this will help me, uh, uh, you know what? I'll probably be better served just fighting him here and building more troops. Since I have the manpower. If he wipes me out, he'll just send me to another place. Or if he beats me there, he'll just send me to another place. Alright, I'm taking Kent here so I can cross the strait better. I don't even think I want Kings County. Yeah. Oh, nope. Looks like I've got a... Did it the old-fashioned way. Oh, 
that would be clever. Wouldn't it? That would be clever. I can't cross because they have both sides. their fleet. Alright. That's definitely not smart. <clears throat> we'll just blockade a little bit with these guys. Dudes, how you doing? <laughs> Get fucked, England. Well, that's not fun. Looks like England actually understands. Never mind. <clears throat> Looks like blockading is out of the question. Uh, I'm gonna build more cogs. Let's use the outliner. Or this... this thing. This thingy. Eight. I think 20 would be good. That blockade hurts a bit. Alright, uh, we really just want Kalei out of this. Um, so we're getting, we're getting there. Maybe take Kent. That's doable. Alright, um... Let's uh, start working with outraged countries. The most important thing is we have to take London. Nothing else really matters here. She's got a cannon sitting there. So it's got two forts stacked on top of each other. That's pretty... It's not clever. Come 
Come on, thing. I gotta make sure to watch for clever English English things. Oh, how long have I been stacked out on points? Let's embargo. I hope I remember to embargo England. I probably didn't because I'm an idiot. Um, da -da 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 -da. So, where is? Where do I want to develop? Groningen. So that is in Friesland. Alternatively, just do more in Utrecht. Uh, I think it's fine to put the development in both for now. And then do that. There we go, got that up to 20. Get this up to 10. This one's developed, so. There we go. That leaves me enough points to do other things with. There we go, we took London. Alright, quick, quick dirty war. Alright, so where's their next fort? 